Hello everyone and welcome to Pendlemi DU. Good morning and thank you for joining in learners. I am Manisha and I welcome you to our very own platform Pendulum EDU. Thank you for joining in learners. I hope I'm clearly audible to all of you. Can, you can quickly let me know if I'm clearly audible. And I am waiting for your responses learners. Quickly let me know if I am clearly audible to all of you right here. हेलो संजीव आई होप आई एम आई होप कि आपको जो वॉल्यूम का प्रॉब्लम है वो भी फिक्स हो गया है राइट चलो लेट्स बिगिन विद द सेशन दिस इज एस एस सी मिसलेनियस प्रैक्टिस सेशन गाइस एंड वी गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट दिस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू uh as every day every morning we come up for practice session at 10 am baki sab jin jo naye hain unko bata du ki roz subha 10 baje monday to saturday we come up with a practice session for miscellaneous ssc practice session okay all right so let's begin with the session for today learners i hope that you guys are doing well and taking good care of yourself and your family let's start Now the very first question that we have is a close passage, and I want you to answer that. If you read it, it is one bright day in blank autumn. A family of ants uh, were bustling about in the warm sunshine. One bright day in blank autumn. Lately, late, later, latter. Quickly fill in the blank for the first one. संजीव सेज इट विल बी ए लेटली लेटली इज रिसेंटली आप मुझे एक बात बताओ क्या लिखा है इन ब्लैंक ऑटम ऑटम में और यहां पर कैसा ऑटम यही एडजेक्टिव चाहिए एडवर्ब नहीं चाहिए संजीव ए इज रॉन्ग नॉट लेटली बट इट विल बी इन लेट ऑटम लेट दैट इज एन एडजेक्टिव मतलब जो कि बाद वाला ऑटम है मतलब ऑटम सीजन में कुछ समय देर ठीक है लेट ठीक है इन लेट ऑटम आशीष हेलो आशीष यस बहाइंड टाइम यस जैसे हम कहते हैं लेट गोल और लेट अराइवल राइट वैसे ही लेट ऑटम सीजन में हम लेट की बात कर रहे हैं यस हेलो सोनल ओके इट विल बी ऑप्शन बी नेक्स्ट द राइट ऑल्सो हियर नेक्स्ट वन इन लेट ऑटम फैमिली फैंस वो बसलिंग अराउंड अबाउट इन द वॉर्म सनशाइन ड्राइंग आउट द ग्रेन दे हैड स्टोर्ड अप ब्लैंक द समर बताएंगे पूरे समर में जो उन्होंने ग्रेन स्टोर की थी वो उसको ड्राई कर रही थी ड्राई आउट ओके सोनल बी इज राइट नाउ हियर ड्यूरिंग ड्यू टू सिंस और बाय बताएंगे पूरे समर के दौरान उस पूरे समर सीजन के दौरान उन्होंने जो भी ग्रेन स्टोर अप की थी दे वर ड्राइंग इट आउट सो व्हाट विल कम समर सीजन के दौरान गाइस दिस इज व्हाट वी टॉकिंग अबाउट यस सूरज आशीष दैट्स राइट ड्यूरिंग द समर वेरी गुड वेरी गुड ड्यूरिंग द समर That's correct. पूरे समर सीजन में उन्होंने जो इकट्ठा किया था वेरी वेल डन आशीष सूरज ड्यूरिंग इज एब्सोल्यूटली करेक्ट नेक्स्ट वन द समर वेन अ स्टार्विंग ग्रास हॉप स्टार्विंग मतलब भूखा हिज फिडल अंडर इज आर्म केम अप एंड हम्बली बेग फॉर अ ब्लैंक टू ईट फॉर अ ब्लैंक टू ईट वॉट फॉर अ बिट फॉर अ बिटर फॉर अ बाइट फॉर अ बिटर बताएंगे Quickly tell me, the grasshopper begged for a what?
B. Bit. Someone is saying bitter. Someone is saying bit. Yes, he asked for a blank to eat. For a bit or for a bite. For a bite or for a bit. Is me. Look, bitter. To nahi aayega. Bitter nahi aayega. This will not come. Yes, Akash. That's right. Thoda sa manga hoga. Bilkul. So it will be for a bit. For a bit. Matlab thoda bahut. Kuch de do. Right. Yes, option A is absolutely right. Jinonika Sanjeev, Pankaj, Akash, option A is absolutely correct. That is a bit. So, Usne, he asked for something to eat, some little bit to eat. Yes. Kathan, a little bit. Vaise hi. Vaise hi. Next. What crisis? Sorry, what? Cried the ants in surprise. Haven't you stored anything away for the winter? What in the world were you doing all last summer? I didn't blank time to store up any food. I didn't blank time to store up any food. Quickly tell me. Good morning, Abhishek. Quickly. Did we have, did I didn't blank time to store up any food? What do we understand by this? Yes, Ashish, that's right. I didn't have because we did we use first form of verb. That is absolutely correct. I didn't have time to store up any food. That is absolutely right. Yes, Sonal option A is right. Surat, Sanjeev, very good. Pankaj, Ashish, Akash, that's correct for all of you. Sonal, that's right. Next one. Vine the grasshopper. I was so busy making music that before I knew it, the summer was blank. Before I knew it, the summer was what? Going, goes, go, gone. It's very obvious that with was, we will not use go or goes. So, summer was going or summer was gone. We have only two options. Baki do eliminate hum easily kar sakte hai, right? Did plus have. Yes, that's right. Ashish, Abhishek, Suraj, Abhishek, Akash, gone. Yes. The moment we came to know, the grasshopper says, the moment I came to know, it was already gone. That's right, Pankaj. D is correct, not A, Pankaj. Okay. Sanjeev was going. Season ja raha tha, ye kaise hota? Bita season wo cheez khatam ho chuki thi. It was already gone. It will be D that's gone. So you have to understand the text and only then you can be answerable. Okay. Next. Error. You have to give me the error. They also were very beautiful creature. But they dressed in duller colors and do not have slender waist. Bataye. Where does the error lie? Quickly. A, A, people are saying A. What is the error in A? They also were very beautiful. What's the error here? Sorry. We can see also, if you are confused, then this is correct. Hai, aisa kuch hai. Because also can be placed, they were also, we can also say they also were very beautiful. They also, you can emphasis kar rahe. they also, they also were very beautiful. Hai, they were also very beautiful. Aap, they also were. Jab aapko subject par emphasize zyada karna hota hai, then you attach also just next to it. So this is absolutely right. Iski placement mein koi galti nahi hai. Where is the error? I will tell you now. The error is here. Do not ke jaga it will be did not. See, past, past. This is present. This is wrong. So it will be did not. They also were very beautiful creatures, but they dressed in dollar colors and do not have. So it will be and did not have slender waist. So the entire text goes in past. We cannot use a present verb form here. We have to change it into did. No suraj. There is no superlative form. 
there is no superlative form now beautiful that's the positive degree of adjective it's not a superlative degree i hope this is clear to each one of you now shall we go ahead all right then let's go ahead error another error we have if they were dressed in yellow or red any passing bird has seen them and there is no telling what might happen duller colors isliye kaha ja raha hai because ye sentence mein definitely kisi cheez ka jaise aapne likha na they also were to aapko isi se pata lag raha hai ki ye definitely kisi cheez ye sentence mein kisi cheez se comparison state kiya ja raha hai ye kya hai ye inferred hai inferred hai to jab hum kisi se compare kar rahe hain to comparative form bilkul correct hai sentence mein yes b the so people are saying that it will be b what's the problem in b okay pankaj said it's c abhishek is saying it's b now see if they were dressed in yellow or red any passing bird has seen them wrong had seen them it will be option D had seen past. Guys, if you are not reading the sentence properly, lengthy sentence है आप tense का structure. You all need to work on your tenses. Be very particular when you read a sentence. Nobody told me D. सब ने A B C कहा, but nobody said D, which is wrong. Yes, uh, Akash, very good Akash. Yeah. Would have, would be कर सकते हैं. That will be past. We can say would have seen. that is also right yes suraj it will be d exactly exactly that's absolutely right i hope the text is now clear to all of you next one one day fine looking okay kek what's that kekropia moth came out of her chrys chrysalis and clung to the nearest twig while her wings grew and dried and flattened batayenge quickly yes we've already taken up that one day fine looking kekropia moth came out of her chrysalis uh, chrysalis and clung to the nearest twig while her wings grew and dried and flattened where would the where is the error where do you see the error quickly where is where we haven't taken is anywhere learners quickly let me know abhishek says b what what in b she says one so quickly tell me what what is the reason also you have to tell me that also otherwise that won't be clear you have to justify your answer while where hona chahiye while okay while ke jagah where where her new wing her wings grew and dried okay see it says one day it came out to the to the clung to the nearest twig while her wings grew and dried and flat while is right there is no problem with while here abhishek there is no problem with while here ashish abhi dekho sab ka jawab change hota ja raha hai i must tell you it is option b this use of preposition is wrong aaj jo errors hain aap logon ke liye bahut problematic ho rahe hain I don't know why error में से एक भी अभी तक ये आपने ठीक नहीं बताया है which is sad the preposition usage is wrong rest everything is fine it's option B rest everything is fine 
Next one. When I get my wings, I may meet people who are better off than him. Quickly tell me. Now this one comes from personal pronouns. If you can guess the error, if you can make out the error, this comes from this comes from personal pronouns. Ashish, I told you, clung on. Kisi cheese ke upar. Jaise twig hai, wo kya hoti hai? Branch. Uski upar aise lapak ke baitna. So it's on. Yes, Abhishek. Your, your answer option B was right. Suraj says it will be A. Suraj, that's wrong. Who is for people? So our plural form is absolutely right. No. Who are better? Who better are off? No, no, that's wrong, Suraj. This is correct. There's no problem with this. After then, whenever you're making a comparison, we usually place, you know, he, that is nominative case. What do we place? We place the nominative case. Now, nominative case is like when we say he, she, it, they. That is the nominative case. That is the nominative case. So after that, we are going to make use of he instead of him because him is the objective case. So than he. For example, I am be better than she, right? She, that is again nominative case. It is definitely going to be he and not him. I hope that you've revised the pronouns part. We did this in personal pronoun section. If you do not remember, after preposition, there is objective case. Preposition ke baad, objective case comes. And after all these, then we use in case of comparison, he. So you should be well aware of this, learners. If you are not, then it's going to trouble you. You have to be well, well aware of it. Yes. Uh, Ashish, ye kahi se aai nahi hai. these are all framed by me, so I have given it to you. But I thought that today let's do something difficult because you were got used to things easy. Now you should know that yes, if difficult level comes up, it's going to be this way. This is not CHSL. I am making it you practice for SSC, whether it's mains or pre, that is tier one, tier two, whatever. But we are preparing it for CGL, CHSL, and every bit of it, okay? All right, let's go ahead on to the next one, learners. Now, the answer here would be C. Next one is another error. The fur in her fat body was matted and wet. Quickly tell me. The fur in her fat body was matted and wet. Batayenge. Sure, Abhishek, sure. We'll be doing such questions. Do not, do not worry. The fur in her fat body was matted and wet. Batayenge. Ashish says second. No, Ashish. It's right. Second one is wrong. Aisa nahi hai. Was matted. Matted matlab. Thoda sa wo matted tha. Wet tha. Geela tha. Matted tha. Bilkul thik hai. Idhar koi error nahi hai. Error is in option A, guys. The fur in her body. Fur body ke andar nahi hota hai. Fur on body hota hai. The fur on her fat body was matted and wet. Fur kaisi hoga? Fur to singular hai. This is singular. Yes, Suraj. A is right, Suraj. It is going to be on. That's right, Suraj. Option A is correct. The fur on her fat body. Okay, next one. Guys, thoda dhyan se. Thik hai, aur revise kar lena is session ko wapas se. Dekhe ga next. Moths are safer in dull colors and the egg layers should always be the safer of all. Batayenge. Moths are safer in dull colors and the egg layers should always be the safer of all. Batayenge, ye wala thoda easy hai. Main hint de deti hoon, adjectives ka jo error hai, ye waha se hai. Ab aap mujhe bata dijiye where is the error? Adjective ka hai. Batayenge. Okay, Suraj Sonal is right. Suraj says B. Suraj keh rahe option B. Let's check up Suraj. We'll check up. Vanraj is saying D. Ashish bhi keh rahe hai D. Yes, Vanraj. That's right. 
it will be safest very good safest because the safest of all sub se compare kar rahe hain to highest degree aayegi superlative degree aayegi article the bhi laga hai to superlative form bilkul sanjeev ashish akash suraj bilkul correct answer sorry one raj d is the correct answer very well said aage badhte hain on the next one Their brown wings are so nearly the color of dead leaves or bark that you might often look right at them without seeing them. But I'm getting. Their brown wings are so nearly the sick, the color of dead leaves or bark that you might often look right at them without seeing them. But I'm getting. Quickly. Where is the error? color of dead leaves that might look ashish says it is an a ashish ne kaha hai a part mein error hai let's see others baki log bhi batayenge fatafat suraj says it's c Sanjeev is also saying A. What is the error? What is the error? Reason, batayenge for Dafat sir. Reason. Yes, Sanjeev. There is wrong. That's right. It will be their brown wings. Very good. Very good. Suraj Abhishek, uh, Sanjeev Abhishek and Ashish. Suraj C is wrong. Aage badte hain. Is it clear? This one was. Uh, this one was easy to guess. Yes, Ashish. That's right. Akash. They go pronunciation same. Hai, to confuse ho sakte hain, but do not get confused. Next one. Another error. If anything happened to them, you know there will be no caterpillar babies. Batayenge. If anything happened to them, you know there will be no caterpillar babies. past conditional ka hai batayenge quickly yes ashish that's right it will be wood yes if anything happened to them present model ki jagah past model aayega So it will be wood. That's right, Ashish and Sanjeev. Wood will come. Bilkul. That's correct. Suraj, D is right. Aage badte hain. Next one. This is second conditional. Second conditional. Okay. Let's go ahead. One Raj. That's right. Suraj. Next. Some of the butterflies, you know, wear whole gowns from black and yellow. Some of the butterflies, you know, wear whole gowns from black and yellow. But I'm going quickly. Yes, Sanjeev. Yes, three p.m. Wali class hogi. Bilkul hogi. Voice C C G L Tier One practice. Tier One previous year papers. Quickly, so, Ashish is saying third part. Mirror. Some of the butterflies, you know, wear whole gowns from black and yellow. No, so Ashish error is in part B. That is in black and yellow color. बता रहे हैं. So from नहीं आएगा. In आएगा. It will be B. Option B. Sanjeev का जो शायद है B वो सही है. The color for color we use preposition in. It will be in black and yellow and not uh, from black and yellow. Suraj, you हमेशा plural form लेता है. It will be you know and not you knows. It will take you know. It will be option B. Okay. Next one. Incorrectly spelled word. बताएंगे quickly. Incorrectly spelled word. Incorrect deletion specialist staircase. Incorrectly spelled word. कोई बात नहीं आशीष. Now you know it. Okay. B 
like sure mm. of something yes let me know learners incorrectly spell word okay sanjeev ashish abhishek one raj everyone yes that's right it takes double s ingress means the right or the capacity of entering capacity or capability of entering into some some place or some situation yes everyone is right a is absolutely right next one appropriate synonym of the given word you need to give me appropriate synonym of access batayenge synonym to access sonal a was right for the last one ingress Access is like you're allowed to do something, right? A viable admittance, frenzy, aggravate. What is synonym? Kisi cheese ki aapko permission di hui hai. Access hai aapke pas. Yes, one Raj, admittance. Yes, acceptance. Yes, that's right. That's right. Sanjeev, one Raj, bilkul. That's right. Option B. One Raj, A, viable is something that's possible or that's feasible. Okay, so that won't be the answer. Yes, that won't be the answer. Yes. So B is right for everyone. Aage badte hai. Next one, we have an idiom. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. What's that? Out of bounds. Restricted, embrace, settle or limitless. Quickly. Vanraj is there, Abhishek. Vanraj is there. He answered B. What is the what is the meaning of this idiom? Out of bounds. Four. People are saying four, that is D. Yes, limitless. Yes, that's right. Limitless. That's absolutely, absolutely correct. Because this is something that's unrestricted. Unrestricted is out of bound. Unrestricted is out of bound. Next one we have is a sentence improvement and replacement part for you. So Rapunzel grows on to be a beautiful child with long golden hair. Quickly. Rapunzel grows on to be a beautiful child with long golden hair. What will, what will be the answer? Up to be a, for to be a, up to be or no improvement. Quickly. I'm waiting for your responses, guys. A. Yes, that's right. Because for grow, we always use up. We do not use on. We use up. Rapunzel grows up. That's right. That's right for everyone. Abhishek, Ashish, Suraj, B is wrong. We cannot say grow for. Yes, A is right. Let's go ahead on to the next part. Akash Sanjeev, that's right. You have to give me incorrectly spelled word. This is the wrongly spelled word, something that's incorrect. Irritable, comprehension, delinquent, reprisal. Incorrect word. Irritable, comprehension, delinquent and reprisal. Sure, Ashish, I'll take note of that. Do not worry, I'll take note of that. Let's first complete this. We'll do that also. Exactly. It's simple. We do not need double S. We need single S. Yes, everyone is right. Everyone is right. Nobody has given it in correct. Akash, Abhishek, Avanraj, Sanjeev, Sonal. Yes, Abhishek. That's right. Let's go ahead. There's another close for you. Close. 
Rapunzel is a German fairy tale recorded by the brothers Grimm and first published in 1812 as part of children's and household tales. The brothers Grimm's story is blank adaptation of is a one all or an. Yes, single S, that's right. Yes, one Raj, D is right. D is right. Suraj, not one. Article agar laga is an adaptation. Is one adaptation nahi? It is an adaptation. That is right. An will come. Not one. Beta, one is not making any sense. Is one adaptation? No, it is an adaptation of the fairy tale. <clears throat> Next one. By... Frederick Sluice, 1790, that blank, a translation of personet. That are, was, were, had. Thangi. Acha, this phrase, this passage is in past. Remember this. The passage is going in past. But here, the sentence is in present. What will we do? The sentence is in present by, okay, 1790. Oh, we are again in past. Vapas hum past mein aage. Kya hoga? Yes, that was a translation. Because 1790 ki baat kare hum. That's correct. It will be worse. That was a translation of. Yes, Akash, Ashish, Abhishek, Vanraj. B is absolutely correct. Next one. A uh, translation of Persinet by Charlotte Rose de, de La Force. Blank was itself influenced by an earlier Italian tale. Blank, who, which, when, whom. This is name of a person. Right? This is name of a person. What will come? Which? No. No, this is the book, this is the story. Iske liye which aa sakta hai. By, that means this is the person. Person ke liye who aega? Who, that's A, not which. What are you guys doing? Ashish, Abhishek, Vanraj and Akash, you are right. Vanraj and Akash, you are right. It will be who. Option A, yes, that's right. Who? Exactly, it's a name C, by. By is definitely used when you have to name a person, right? Next one. Was itself influenced by an earlier tale, Petro Petrosinella, by Giambatti Subsail. The tale is classified as Arne Thompson type 310, The Maiden in Tower. Blank plot has been used and parodied in various media. But I get is ka is ka jo plot hai is story ka plot use kiya gaya hai kafi sare plays me kafi sare media ne use kiya hai. It's they, it's their is story ka play. But I get no their plot. But a kis ka plot the tale is classified the tale singular hai their kese use kar rahe ho aap. Singular hai. Yes, Akash. It's option C. One Raj. That's right. It's plot. Yes, Ashish, Abhishek. It's is correct. Very well said, Sanjeev. That's right. Next one says, it's, dekho, yaha par use kiya na, it's, it's best known line, Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair, let down your hair, is an idiom in blank culture. Batayenge. Is an idiom in popularity, population, popular, populist. Culture is noun, so we definitely an adjective to qualify usko qualify karne ke liye. what will come. What will come, guys? Yes, popular. Sanjeev, you are right. Option C. In popular culture. That's absolutely correct. Yes, Akash, Ashish, option C is right. Very good. Next one. Incorrectly spelled word. We have one more for you. Incorrectly spelled word. Inconvenient, vacuum, vacuity, hoover. Bataye. Yes. 
Which one is incorrect here? Sonal 10 o'clock. We start around 10.45. We finish. 10.45 tak finish ho jayegi class. Vacuum. Vanraj keh rahe hain. Ashish keh rahe third. Yes, third is wrong. Option C. E ki zarurat yahan nahi hai. Vacuity ka matlab hota hai empty headedness. Yes, option C is right. Chale aage badte hain on the next parts guys. Yes, Sanjeev, C is right, C is correct, option C is right. We have one more close passage. Aaj to aap ye third close kar rahe ho, teesra close kar rahe guys. Chale dekhenge. Old Riddler had some very peculiar characteristics. Blank others, he was a genome. About, around, among, with. Batayenge. Quickly. Genome jo hai negative word hota hai. Thik hai? Genome jo hai, madab, kisi ko bura ke ne ke liye. Thik hai? About others, beta nahi, Ashish. About others to galat hoga. Logo ke samaksh, logo ke beach, to kya hoga? Among others. Among others. Jab wo logo ke beach hota hai, he was a jino, matlab, an ugly person. Thik hai? Yes, Abhishek, among, bilkul correct hai. Very good, Abhishek. Very good. Among others, he was a jino, matlab, jab logo ke beach mein hota hai. So, it will be option C, among. Next. Living underground for the greater part of his time, he had ample opportunities of working out curious and artful riddles. Okay? He had a lot riddles ko solve karta tha, which he used to try on his fellow genomes. He tried on his fellow genomes. Try karta tha. And if they liked them, he blank go above ground. He, if they liked them, past mein ja rahe hain, he blank go above ground. Would, will, could, might. Tell us. अगर उनको अच्छा लगता था तो फिर वो और आगे जाके एंड प्रोपाउंड हिज कोनांड्रम्स कोनांड्रम्स का मतलब यही रिडल्स ठीक है पहेलियां टू द कंट्री पीपल अगर उसके साथ ही लोगों को अच्छी लगते थे तो फिर वो कंट्री पीपल और लोगों के पास लेके जाता था यस दैट्स राइट वुड ही वुड विलिंगनेस बताना है इसलिए वो डाएगा क्या बता रहे हैं विलिंगनेस सर्व इच्छा उसकी स्व इच्छा Yes, that's right, Ashish, Sanjeev, Abhishek. Very good. Option A is absolutely correct. It will be wood. That's right. Yes. Next. So he would go to the country people who sometimes blank them, but not often. Jo kabi kabi us usko shayad pasand karte the. Option me kya hai? Guess. Kuch log guess kar lete the, kuch nahi. So who sometimes what? Guess it, guessed it, guessing, guesses. Bataye. Quickly. Quickly. Bida past me ja rahe hum. Kis me past me hai? Is baat ko dhyan rakhenge. No, Ashish, past me hai hum, bida. Yes, guessed. Abhishek, bilkul. So sometimes guessed them, but not often. Okay, bilkul. That's right. Option B is correct. Abhishek, because we are past ki baat kar rahe hai. Okay? Chale. Next. Yes, Sanjeev, B is right. B is absolutely correct. Option B. He, wo dekho, pura sentence ek saath ja raha hai na. That's why. Next. The fact is that those person who wished to be blank good terms with the old genome never guessed his riddles. Jo log uske saath achche terms pe hona chahate the, wo kabhi uski riddles ko guess nahi karte the. Batayenge kyu? Us achche terms mein hona kya hoga? On, in, by, at. Ye to aapko pata hona chahiye. Ye phrase hai. To be in. Abhishek keh rahe in. Abhishek in galat hai bita. In good terms nahi hota. Sorry. In is wrong, Abhishek. Yes, 
गलत है इन गुड टर्म्स नहीं होता है हमेशा ऑन गुड टर्म्स होता है ये आप लोग फ्रेज प्लीज आई एम नॉट ऑन गुड टर्म्स विद हिम आई एम नॉट ऑन बेटर टर्म्स विद हिम वी कैन यूज इट्स ऑन बेटा अगर आपको नहीं पता तो इसको प्लीज याद कर लेंगे इट्स इम्पॉर्टेंट इट विल बी ऑन ऑन गुड टर्म्स ये सक्षम दैट्स राइट ऑन ऑप्शन ए इज राइट ऑन गुड टर्म्स नेक्स्ट वन वी हैव इज क्यों वो गैस नहीं करते थे दे न्यू दैट दे वुड प्लीज हिम बेटर बाय ब्लैंक दैम कहते हैं कि uh, उनको लगता था कि वो उसको प्लीज uh, कर लेंगे ज्यादा अच्छा उसको आंसर दे के बताएंगे क्योंकि वो उसकी उसको प्रूव अगर वो आंसर नहीं कर पाएंगे तो उसको प्रूव हो जाएगा ना कि यस वो बहुत अच्छी रिडल्स बनाता है वो खुश हो जाएगा तो उसको बेटर हैप्पी uh, रखने के लिए वो लोग उसकी ज्यादा यस बाय गिविंग देम आप गिविंग बाय के बाद आईएनजी फॉर्म आता है बाय के बाद आफ्टर के बाद यूजली हम आई फॉर्म ऑफ वर्ब लेते हैं इवन आफ्टर बिफोर बिफोर के बाद भी यस ऑप्शन इज राइट बाय गिविंग देम अप बाय गिविंग यस सक्षम अभिषेक सोनल लक्ष्य वनराज बिल्कुल करेक्ट है बाय गिविंग देम अप संजीव बीइंग गिविन क्यों आ रहे बेटा पैसिव में है ही नहीं सेंटेंस पैसिव में है ही नहीं सेंटेंस सो गाइज द सेशन कम्स टू एन एंड टूडे लाइ राइट ठीक है आशीष बेटा वैसे इन सब की एक क्लास ऐसे नहीं होता मैं वर्क फॉर्म पर क्लास ले लूंगी आपके साथ बट द पॉइंट इज जब मैंने आपको पूरा ग्रामर कॉन्सेप्ट एस में पढ़ाया है मैंने हर एक पॉइंट पढ़ाया है अगर आप लोगों ने सेशन मैंने इसलिए कहा था नोट्स बनाइए हमने इसलिए आपके साथ पी शेयर की है टेलीग्राम ग्रुप पर हर सेशन की ताकि आपको कहीं भी कोई चीज मिस ना हो तो मैंने ये सब चीज वहां कवर की है राइट तो यू हैव टू यू हैव टू वर्क ऑन इट योर सेल्फ ऑल्सो थैंक यू सो मच लर्नर्स फॉर ज्वाइनिंग इन तीन बजे मिलते हैं एस की क्लास के लिए टिल देन थोड़ा सा ध्यान रखेंगे एंड प्रैक्टिस करते रहेंगे थैंक यू सो मच लर्नर्स फॉर ज्वाइनिंग इन फॉर टुडे कीप लर्निंग कीप ड्रॉइंग एंड नॉट टू फॉरगेट टू लाइक एंड शेयर द वीडियो